Hello everyone, I'm Jessica Blackbird. Welcome to my channel. Please like, share, and subscribe. Well, Mystical, a rapper from New Orleans, is in some big trouble. Thanks, Lauren. Just some breaking news. Rapper Mystical has been arrested and booked into the Ascension Parish Jail on his third count of alleged sexual crimes. Real name, Michael Tyler, and he's been accused of rape twice in the past two decades. According to arrest records, 50, the 52-year-old, better known by his stage name, Mystico, was arrested Sunday and booked on several charges, including false imprisonment and first-degree rape. According to 4WWL, rapper Mystical arrested facing RAPE charges in Louisiana. Mystical was convicted almost two decades ago of SEXUAL battery and was recently cleared of a second allegation of RAPE and kidnapping. Rapper Mystical, who has faced assault charges in the past, was booked on several charges, including first degree RAPE on Sunday in Louisiana, multiple media outlets report. According to The Advocate, 51-year-old Michael Tyler was booked into the Ascension Parish Prison on Sunday afternoon on charges of first-degree RAPE, felony domestic abuse by strangulation, simple battery, and criminal damage to property. A spokesperson for the parish sheriff's office confirmed to the newspaper that Tyler is mystical, a New Orleans rapper who is best known for his 2000 hit single, Shake Ya Ass. Mystical was convicted almost two decades ago of SEXUAL battery and was recently cleared of a second allegation of RAPE and kidnapping stemming from a 2016 allegation. He pled guilty in 2003 to SEXUAL battery and served six years in prison. Wow, you guys, I remember that song from way back then. And I, I listen to a lot of different music. I don't know any of his other music, but I remember that song. And also, I know people who went to his concerts and actually met him in person, women, I know. And they were, you know, they didn't have any bad thing to say about him. But lots of times, once a celebrity, if you will, he doesn't have much celebrity anymore. He doesn't have any new music or anything like that. I've been, you know, trying to find what he's done lately. But a lot, lots of times, uh, in my opinion, people, um, they just tag on to claims of previous um, transgressions, crimes, whatever you want to call them. And many times it's for money. But we I'm not sure if he really did this or, you know, what's the deal? But we will stay on top of this. Right now it's just an accusation. And... We'll have to see once it goes to court what happens. But um, after the Amber Heard, Johnny Depp stuff, we can't say believe all women because if we had believed her, or let me speak for myself, if I had believed her, Johnny Depp would not have won that case. And he deserved, in my opinion, to win because she was the actual abuser. So I learned from that situation, we can't believe. We can't believe all women and we can't believe all men. We have to believe the facts once they're presented. So let's keep up with this and see where it goes. And you know, it's automatic when someone is a rapper, um, people think the worst about them. But I'm not going to think the worst of this guy because I read his story before I made this video and he comes from humble beginnings from a, a, a pretty good family. They were close and he struggled a lot in his life, which does not give him uh, the innocent card, but I'm going to reserve my criticism until I see 
where what evidence is being presented. And as you know, everything comes out, I'll make sure to cover it in my videos. All right, you guys, let me know what you think in the comments. And